Now our Commitment 2014 election coverage and two proposals competing for tax dollars in Salinas. More from Action News reporter Felix Cortez. He's live outside City Hall. Well, Dan, the City Council has already voted to put a one cent sales tax hike on the November ballot. And today, another group walked into City Hall hoping to get their tax proposal before voters as well. But they have to qualify for the ballot box, and today a group calling itself the Salinas Committee for Public Safety turned in more than 13,500 signatures to the city clerk. The public safety group is calling theirs a special tax and say the money can only be used for public safety, like hiring 100 new officers, more code enforcement officers, and equipment for firefighters. The city's tax is a general tax, which means the city can spend the money as it pleases. The mayor says it will be used to repair streets, sidewalks, recreation centers, and improve public safety. Well, the problem with the general fund tax, number one, it has no boundaries. It could be used for anything. Number two, it's not guaranteed. And number three, you may trust your mayor and city councils this year, but their priorities change on annual basis. If we don't do what's right, then they should throw us out of office at election time. Stop fooling around. It's our job to be responsible, and we should stand up and take care of it and fix what's needed in the city, and that would be what we do with our money. Well, those signatures that were turned in today have yet to be certified, probably looking at early next year at a special election should it qualify the cost to taxpayers roughly $200,000 for that special election. The tricky part comes should both those measures pass. State law prohibits both those tax measures from being implemented. This is an issue that could end up in a courtroom. Dan. All right. Thank you very much, Felix. Uh, to add some clarification, too, both measures want to increase the sales tax by one cent. Since the city's measure is a general tax, it needs a 50% plus one to pass. The public safety tax is a special tax that needs a two-thirds vote to pass.